in the Taft Stadium. 1-0 in favor of OKC Energy as they have looked very strong in that first half. They could easily be up two or three goals. Charlie Lyon making a couple of saves in between the sticks for Seattle Sounders too. So let's take a look at what went down in the first 45 minutes with our first half highlights. Very exciting stuff in attack for Oklahoma City Energy Football Club. And it started basically with Kyle Hyland. He was the main protagonist in the first half. This service here for Danny Koenig was excellent in Koenig knows. And he should have put that one away. It's been a tough season for the King, but once he gets it going in terms of the goal scoring, he is pretty much unstoppable, but he just missed that chance. There's a beautiful ball sent in by Highland. And then Craven setting up Highland. And this one surprised Charlie Lyon, although not the goal surprised him, but that shot right there did not surprise him as Highland was played through by Craven. And then the Seattle Saunders, two captain, was able to finish. Now, this is the play that surprised the goalkeeper. Look, he's standing there, didn't expect it. It might have taken a deflection, but whatever the case, it's a goal for Kyle Highland, who was. Definitely, easily the man of the match so far for Seattle as he scores in the 11th minute. It's 1-0 at this point. And then Lyon bats away this effort by Linus Olsen. And it's Kaelin Ryden providing the service inside. They are getting a lot of good chances coming from the left side of their attack. Now, it's been a little bit of a struggle for the right side of the defense of OKC because of Daniel Gonzalez's Dylan Remick tried to exploit the space there, but it was kept out by a Seattle, excuse me, OKC defense that has been very, very tough, especially in the final third. Cody Lorendi has not had to make a save in this match. Here's a chance for Michael Thomas as the first half came to an end. And once again, it's Ryden providing the service on the left side of the attack. And then this is when things started to get a little chippy. Koenig takes offense to a push by Alfaro, who definitely deserved a yellow card for the first one. He was antagonizing Koenig, Koenig defending for himself, and the referee, Nima Sagafi, is the one that gives both of them a yellow card. And then Highland looking for a brace, but he sends that one 